January 2001. An earthquake measuring 7.9 on the Richter scale hit northwest India. An estimated 120,000 people were reported missing. International Rescue Corps deployed a team of search and rescue specialists to the area. So severe was the quake, it shook the entire Indian subcontinent, rocking buildings from Pakistan to India and Nepal. Many in the Asian community here in Britain still don't know if their relatives are among the victims who face an agonizing wait to find out. The earthquake struck at 8.46 in the morning, leaving thousands buried in the rubble. Those who escaped the quake were left desperately searching for their loved ones and in urgent need of help. For the people trapped in the collapsed buildings, it's a race against time. They can only survive for a few days without food or water. The British rescue teams arrive in Bhuj, the city that took the full force of the earthquake. It's already 48 hours since the quake struck and the death toll has quickly risen to 2,000. The International Rescue Corps are ready to work flat out in the knowledge that every hour could mean a matter of life or death. In the 48 hours since the earthquake struck, there have been constant aftershocks. Every time they go into a void, there's the threat that tons of concrete could fall on them at any moment. After four days of searching, the International Rescue Corps have finally confirmed a voice contact. Entombed under tons of concrete, the team have no idea what condition the person is in, and with the possibility of further collapse at any moment, the race is now on to reach the survivor. After half an hour of intense digging, they locate the man's exact position. He tells them his name is Viral, and that the rest of his family were buried with him. Miraculously, after five days in total darkness without food or water, Viral appears to be unscathed, but the rescue workers are concerned that he's suffering from severe dehydration and almost certainly in deep shock. Within half an hour of being taken to hospital, the rescued man Viral returns to the site to help with the search for the missing members of his family. None of them survive. 